Cebu Gubernatorial Bet Gwendolyn Garcia criticized the administration of incumbent Governor Hilario Davide III for abandoning and selling the Cebu International Convention Center, or CICC. But Davide said he was happy to have sold the CICC rather than spend millions to repair it. Here's Chari Coronel for the details. During the Mega Cebu's Claruhaita Candidates Forum earlier, gubernatorial and vice-gubernatorial bets had a chance to present their platforms and programs for the development of Cebu. Among those who joined the forum were gubernatorial candidate Gwendolyn Garcia and her running mate, vice-gubernatorial candidate Daphne Salimbangon, who are running under PDP Laban 1 Cebu. Also present were Governor Hilario David III, who is running for Vice Governor, and his running mate, Vice Governor Agnes Magpale. But the two camps came in a different time. Both two camps were given enough time to deliver their opening message. Garcia criticized the administration of Davide for abandoning and eventually selling the Cebu International Convention Center, or CICC, and other projects and programs she started in her term as governor. But Davide said he was happy to have sold the CICC to the Mandawi City government, rather than spend millions to repair it and still not get their money's worth. During the forum, Garcia vowed that those responsible for the selling of the CICC will be held accountable. Garcia described CICC as a prime venue for various activities in Cebu and would have given around 30 million pesos a year to the provincial government. But for the Vide, CICC had so many problems after it was heavily damaged during the earthquake in 2013. The CICC building was the venue for the 2007 ASEAN Summit and Second East Asia Summit. Chari Coronel, Newsbits Tonight.